hybrid MEMS architecture allows us to utilize more than one probe in one test head. We can utilize a, a small cross-section probe for the area of, of the chip that does not draw a lot of current and has a small pitch and for the area of the chip which is typically in the middle that where the chip wants to draw a lot of current we would like to utilize a probe which has a large cross-section so it can deliver a lot of current. In this type of approach without MEMS it is very difficult if not impossible to match the contact force between the skinny probes on the perimeter and the thick probes uh, in the middle of the chip. We are able to use small cross-section probe for the areas on the chip that are with small pitch. Uh, that area typically does not draw a lot of current. And we can use a, a different type of probe with larger cross-section for the middle of the chip. This way, we are able to combine a, a very small pitch probe when it's needed, but in order to be able to deliver a lot of current in the middle of the chip, we are able to, to utilize a larger cross-section probe. This way, it's a hybrid approach. With MEMS we are able to adjust the composition through design and material properties. We can adjust the contact force to be balanced between the skinny and the thick probes, uh, satisfying all requirements.